This is prototype one of your long badges. Right now for mystery of connection also could be used for power and perception. Um, the idea behind badges are that they give students an opportunity, give you an opportunity to select something that you'd like to work on, play on. It's a little bit like uh, some companies where employees get uh, 10 or 20 percent of their weekly time just to um, develop something of their own interest. The only requirement is that it be on the topic and the text that we're doing, but how you do it is really up to you. You can earn badges throughout the year by um, completing quests. So uh, this he, this page here shows you what the different options are at the time of prototype one, and you might put links to different things you make in these boxes. And if you complete enough, uh, enough of them, it gives you a badge. And a badge, the time of prototype one, is equal to a 20-point quiz, a perfect score on a 20-point quiz, which is great for your quiz average. So here are the options. You have the architect, where you actually would use Minecraft or a similar program, there are other architecture programs, um, to design a milieu of biblical scenes. You can always read the description in here. You have the artist, where you would draw three different scenes, and again, the requirements are here. You have the, the comic or the graphic novel genius. You have the game show host, where you would design Oops, where you would design a game show using any of these tools, a quiz show, and possibly even uh, run other students through the game, but we'll come back to that another time. You have the playwright, where you write some dialogues. You have the animator, using um, online animation tools. I'm still looking for more right now. I only have Go Animate, but I know there are more available, and you might actually do some research to find one that you like. The DJ, uh, using making song lists and liner notes and the Poet Laureate. In most cases, you're required to do three of that thing um, sometime during the uh, semester, uh, and you can carry points over. I'm okay with that. Uh, it's either three or four in order to earn the badge in that area. I'm going to also develop uh, badges for um, multiple, uh, you know, in case you do like two of one and one in the other, uh, badges for that, so you don't have to worry about only doing that thing. I haven't quite designed that at the time of prototype one. But that is the plan now. So if you're watching this video for the first time, you might want to review the different options in these different slides. Um, save a copy of this to your, um, to your Google Drive, put your name here, and choose one and start working on it. Uh, in some cases, Mr. Walk might not be available to help you work out the exact details of how it works. Give it your best shot, start working on it. In most cases, uh, because it's a pretty open uh, philosophy behind how to do this, the requirements are, are reasonably light, as long as the work that you do is interesting to you and that it um, depicts the text uh, in accurate and interesting ways.